Gamescom is still going strong over in Germany, and there's still tons of news and announcements every day. To keep you up to date with the latest details, we've got a Gamescom event hub just for you, where you can check out every trailer, demo, and interview. Of course, what better way to get informed than by getting your daily fix? If you think a lot of games were unveiled at Gamescom, you ain't seen nothing yet. Sony plans to announce new titles during its PlayStation press conference at the Tokyo Game Show. Sony boss Shuhei Yoshida told Famitsu that they couldn't even fit all their game announcements into their Gamescom conference, and that the announcements cut will be shown during its TGS keynote, with a focus on PS4-related game announcements. TGS 2014 will run from September 18th to the 21st, and you could bet IGN will be there to cover it. Hell to the yeah! You might have noticed that the Xbox Kinect had a pretty thin showing at Microsoft's press conference. Well, company VP Phil Harrison says we shouldn't be worried, saying that the games shown off at the conference were the games we wanted to highlight in our briefing. The games that we focused on in our briefing were the blockbusters and exclusives for this holiday 2014. We let the developers choose whether they want to use the Kinect. It's one of the tools that they have, and we hope they continue to do so. So do you guys want to see the Kinect return, or are you already over that trend? Let us know in the comments below. Ubisoft has clarified why its upcoming open-world driving game, The Crew, isn't coming to PS3 or Wii U, despite debuting on the Xbox 360. Ubisoft's spokesperson told IGN that it's actually because The Crew is originally built for the new generation of consoles. So when the decision was made to port it to the previous generation of consoles, it was decided to focus solely on the platform closest to the new gen's technical infrastructure, which is the Xbox 360. Sorry, PS3 and Wii U. Better luck next time. Is anybody wondering what's up with Rare these days? Xbox head Phil Spencer confirmed that Rare is indeed working on a new project while considering what they want to do moving forward. Spencer said that they've got some new ideas, they're excited about them, and I think Rare should, can, and will be an important part of our game future. So what would you like to see Rare tackle next? Let us know in the comments below. Hideo Kojima himself announced that both Metal Gear Solid V The Phantom Pain and Metal Gear Solid V Ground Zeroes are coming to PC via Steam. While no release dates have been given, it was confirmed that Ground Zeroes would release first, being the prequel to The Phantom Pain. I'm crossing my fingers that we can one day see all the Metal Gear Solid games on PC. Please? And that's your fix for August 14th. I'm Naomi Kyle, and be sure to get your fix anytime online at IGN.